there, hello there. In case you didn't watch my last video, I am doing something called January. Mm. For this, I'm doing a video every other day this month. For my last video, I did a tutorial on how to make a gigantic Kirby that is in the background currently. Since then, I have burnt my arm. <laughs> Second degree means that it blistered, and it did blister, got a big blister, <laughs> but since I, I have this, I am going to take today a little bit easier and try something that a lot of you guys have been asking me to do, and that is the finger paint. Ugh, I am so excited, I am so excited. I have all my colors laid out here. I did pre-mix my two main colors I think I'm going to be using. Got those, I am excited. Mm. <laughs> uh, yeah, but let's get started. So I think I'm going to start with the blue. Oh, ah, ah, ah. oh cool. Cool. Oh, this is fun. <laughs> okay. Oh, good idea, Jamie. Good. Oh, this is like really good for blending, actually. I am still going to try to do multiple layers. Keep this artsy. I am so ecstatic and so happy right now. <laughs> Uh, I am going to try to paint a landscape today. Landscapes you can afford to be a bit less precise. <laughs> My gosh, this is so much fun. Why is this making me so happy? I don't know, but it's just so good. Like a so. And now I'm going to take my pinkish color that I have and do the base clouds. some green. My plan is just like keep on layering colors so it doesn't have to be perfect the first time around. the Tangled Tower because I think it'll be fun. Finishing up the tower now. Ooh. I'm shadowing. We're trying to. <laughs> Grass blades a little bit, the best I can. <laughs> I've learned that finger painting is not for detailed work. <laughs> it is fun though. Like, I like the style of it, I think. Uh, it's kind of turned into a pointillism style. And now I'm going to finger paint on some Mod Podge. I like that little patch there, I don't know why. It's like blue, really blue. Here we go, Mod Podge. All right. The paint was fun. I have a feeling this is gonna feel gross. It does. <laughs> I never thought I'd finger paint on Mod Podge. <laughs> cool. Uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, Mod Podge is a water-based blue type stuff. <laughs> uh, you can use it as a varnish on your craft projects. I don't recommend putting it on with your hands. It looks like I've ruined the painting, but in reality, it'll dry clear. So, yeah. This is sticky and gross. I think I'm a good. So here is the finished finger painting. The grass was hard to do. That was that was unexpected. I don't think it turned out that bad. Also, something exciting and new. I now have enamel pins. This is what my pin looks like. 
this is my first enamel pin that I've done, and it'll be available in my Etsy store next week. That being said, if you'd like to be the first person to own this pin, please leave a nice comment down below, anything you'd like. I will pick one of the comments, and I will announce the winner in my next video. I uh, am. Yeah, I'm really happy with how this turned out, and good. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll be seeing you every other day this month. Bye! Surprise, surprise, bye!